Hey beauties, I'm Bianca Renee and you're watching Bianca Renee today and today is Foundation Friday, but I actually don't have a foundation per se. I have a CC cream. So this is the IT Cosmetics Your Skin But Better CC Plus Cream. So first let me break down the difference between a foundation, a BB cream, and a CC cream. If you don't know what foundation is, you must be new to my channel. I'm Bianca Renee, and I do Foundation Fridays every Friday. So I just need you to go ahead and click that little subscribe button so we can be a little, you know, more acquainted. But foundation is that liquidy, you know, stuff, makeup that you put on your skin to make yourself look flawless. And then there's BB cream, which is technically just a tinted moisturizer. And then after BB creams, they created CC creams, I think it's even DD creams now. And the difference between a BB cream, which is like, you know, your lotion moisturizer with a little bit of a tint, so that way you get a little bit more, you know, coverage instead of just normal moisturizer. And then a CC cream stands for color correcting, so it's supposed to be more focusing on color correction of any dark spots or redness. So right on the label it says color correcting full coverage cream, so that means this is also going to be a little bit more thicker, a little bit more moussier than the lotion-y feeling of a BB cream. It Cosmetics can be found at Sephora or Ulta. This is 1.8 fluid ounces. It has a little plastic container, which I do think is great for traveling. You're not dealing with any glass. And it does have a pump, which you guys know that I like. And this retails for $38. Now this is one of the first CC or BB creams rather that I've been able to use because usually there's not a lot of color range in the BB CC DD cream world and I do have brown skin and very often the darkest tan just doesn't even work for me. It might match my hand but that's about it. Now unfortunately, even the IT Cosmetics CC Cream only has seven colors to choose from. So we're working with fair, light, medium, medium tan, tan, rich, which is me, and deep. So obviously, there's more colors in the world than seven, so um, this video is for the seven people of this shade. Now my favorite part about the IT Cosmetics CC Cream is that it actually has SPF 50. That's a lot and I am someone that doesn't really like to put sunblock underneath my foundation because usually it makes me even more shiny and oiler than I need to be as an oily skin girl in the first place. So I really like that it's already incorporated in the BB Cream. But without further ado, let me show you exactly how this looks when you first apply it. Starting off on a clean, moisturized face, I'm going to grab the Cover FX Anti-Acne Mattifying Primer. Now let's go ahead and apply our CC Cream. So I'm gonna be using a Beauty Blender today. Let's see how much coverage this really gets. So let me start here on my forehead. And this is the color Rich. Oh, much better. So here's my coverage with about two pumps of product. Now as you can see, it is not drying matte. So if you like that more dewy look, illuminating look. You'll probably get that with this, but right now it makes me, an oily skin girl, pretty nervous because I don't wanna be shiny because I know how shiny I'm going to be at the end of the day. So if I'm starting shiny, <sighs> but now let me try to mattify everything by completing the rest of my face. Oh, the power of hair and makeup. So now that I have my full face on, I am very happy with that. I got it to a more controlled, matte environment. My highlight should be the only thing shining, you know what I'm saying? But it is now currently 2.30 p.m. and on every Foundation Friday that I do, I like to wear my foundation, or CC cream in this case, all day long and then come back at the end of the day to show you how my skin looks. So. I will be back to see if this IT Cosmetics Your Skin But Better CC Plus Cream really does wonders. Back at it again with another shiny face. Okay, well actually, 
I am pretty impressed with my current results. Wow. This is a lot better than I thought it was going to be. But on all honesty, I usually wear this foundation like when I don't care. Like I don't even set my foundation with powder. But now that I actually took the time to make a full face, it did very well. So at this point I'm going to use my oil absorbing sheets. These are by Clean and Clear, but you could use any brand you want. You guys know the drill. And I'm going to see how much oil actually comes off my skin. This is all the oil that came off my skin. You also do see a little bit of color, meaning that it is not transfer proof. So what do you guys think? I mean, I was able to get it back to a matte finish. It didn't have like a crazy coverage to begin with, but then again, it is a CC cream and not a foundation. So for a tinted moisturizer, color correcting moisturizer, I think it does a great job, especially because it has SPF 50. If you enjoyed this foundation Friday or maybe the CC cream Friday, <laughs> Yeah, that just doesn't work. I hope you give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I post two new videos every week, foundation reviews on Friday and curly hair videos on Sunday. And make sure we become best friends by following me on Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat at Ms. Bianca Renee. I always have giveaways going on. I have more behind the scenes and more updates on any foundation or hair product that I review that might not make it in the video. That's where you get all the exclusives. But I hope to see you again next week. Thanks for watching Bianca Renee today.